Good afternoon. We are picking it back up in Matthew. Um, we're in chapter 24, and Jesus is with his disciples, and he's talking about the end times. And um, he's saying that, uh, you know, rumors of war, there will be wars and rumors of wars, and those things are, are normal, and the end is not yet. Um, so what's the opposite of that is peace. So as a watchman, you need to, when they start saying peace, be aware. Um, also talks about false prophets. And we will pick it up in verse 15. Um, Lord, we come to you. We ask for wisdom and understanding as we seek your truth. And we ask you to open eyes and open ears. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So 24 verse 15. When ye therefore shall see the abomination of desolation, which is the devil, the Antichrist, spoken of by Daniel the prophet, stand in the holy place, and it say, Whoso readeth, let him understand. And I thought we'd just go to that verse in Daniel. Um, and it's Daniel 12, 11. And from the time that the daily sacrifice shall be taken away, and the abomination that maketh desolate set up, that's where he's quoting from, there shall be a thousand two hundred and ninety days. Blessed is he that waiteth and cometh to the thousand three hundred and five and thirty days. So that's about three and a half years was the time of tribulation. And I just put that on the shelf for a minute. Um, and that's important. So I'll, I'll explain it in a minute. Then let them, so whosoever readeth, let him understand. Then let them which be in Judea flee into the mountains. So this is the tribulation when Antichrist is on the earth. Let him which is on the housetop not come down to take anything out of his house. Just get out of town. Neither let him which is in the field return back to his clothes. And woe unto them that are with child and to them that give suck in those days. And that's not talking about an actual child. It's that you've, you're, because you're supposed to wait until Christ for the great wedding, which is going to occur with him. He's the bridegroom. Um, and if you're there with a child, then you have spiritually married the Antichrist, the devil. That's what that's talking about. And you certainly don't want to be there. For then shall be great tribulation such as was not since the beginning of the world to this time no nor ever shall be and except those days should be shortened there should be no flesh be saved but for the elect's sake those days shall be shortened and they are shortened so we just looked at it right it was about three and a half years so if we go to revelation 9 5. I'm just going to start from verse 1 of Revelation 9. And the fifth angel sounded, and I saw a star fall from heaven unto the earth, and to him was given the key of the bottomless pit. Who do you think is at the bottomless pit, and who has that key? It's Michael. Michael's the one that's in charge of, of holding back the devil and all of his um, fallen angels. And he opened the bottomless pit, and there arose a smoke out of the pit, as the smoke of a great furnace. And the sun and the air were darkened by reason of the smoke of the pit. And there came out of the smoke locusts upon the earth, those fallen angels. And unto them was given power, as the scorpions of the earth have power. And it was commanded them that they should not hurt the grass of the earth, neither any green thing, neither any tree, but only those men which have not the seal of God in their foreheads. So as long as you have the truth, you have the seal of God in your forehead, these people can't hurt you. As a matter of fact, you have power over them. And to them it was given that they should not kill them, talking about the people with God in their foreheads, but that they should be tormented five months how many? Five months. Not three and a half years. Five months. 
and their torment was as a torment of a scorpion when he striketh the man. It might sting a little, but I think this is more spiritually. And how how did Satan tempt Jesus? He tempted him with scripture. Um, he's a scripture lawyer, and he is the father of all lies. So, um, five months in the time of the locust, even to this day, is May to September. So, um, yeah, I know that's a lot, but we will pick it back up there tomorrow. I, like I said, we didn't get far, <laughs> but there's a lot. So, um, anyway, I love you all. Hope you're having a great day. Love and blessings to you, and um, take care of each other. We'll talk tomorrow.